Hi everyone, welcome back to Crafter Scotty. So this time I would love to talk a little more about uh, records, uh, VHS tapes, uh, laser discs, and CDs, uh, something like that. Uh, well, as you know, in some of the videos um, I talked about uh, records, uh, CDs. Uh, DVDs and also even VHS tapes, uh, even laser discs. Uh, this was a record by Backstreet Boys. So, well, since I was born in the 80s, of course, I'm a generation for the Backstreet Boys. And, uh, well, CDs are much common, but uh, still uh, records made it be like a little bit popular for some people who collected them when I was younger. And, and uh, here's uh, InSync. Uh, actually, this is Bye 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 Record by InSync, and uh, it's still my favorite. And uh, this is not that old, but uh, uh, records by Justin Timberlake. Uh, I believe this was the second album by him. Next, and this is totally different package from the original the original package in the United States as it's not the American version but the here's the you know single record, EP record by Olivia Newton John. Uh, my favorite song Physical. Can you see well? And uh, I actually like Huey Lewis under the news, so well, here's one of the collections by them from my collection. Anyways, I still own lots more uh, VHS videotapes, uh, records, uh, DVDs, and uh, even leather discs as of my collection. And uh, I wanted to share uh, much more collection from much more from the collection, but uh, well, uh, lots of them are in the boxes, in the closet actually, so, uh, well, it's hard to show, and uh, this time I wanted to show you much more st stuff from United States, but uh, actually they are in the closet uh, for now, so, uh, especially VHS tapes or something like that, so, uh, sorry about that, but and uh, this time I found some collection of the CDs, uh, VHS tapes, uh, laser discs, and uh, even CDs uh, by a girls band I used to love and I still love about from 80s uh, who were from my hometown. So I'd love to show those collections for you so you can see the differences of the changes, you know. First, this is the record by a girls band from my hometown. I still love them a lot. And uh, well, this is second record by them, I mean second album by them and as a record. Here are their single series, which means uh, we call, used to call EP records. VHS tapes, so videos from edits. So, in case you don't know uh, how the video tapes, VHS tapes looks like, uh, it was like this back in the time. And, uh, and uh, it looked like this in the back in the time, if you don't know how it looked like when it comes to VHS tapes. As I showed, as I showed you this, uh, I actually I own this concert uh, video as VHS tape, but also I actually uh, own the Razer Disc version too. And uh, please check out my Razer Disc episode and the video sometime when you can. But. Uh, uh, laser disc was like, uh, you know, uh, 
high quality version of the VHS tape and uh, it was not that common but still it was a little popular in Japan and also England in the past and uh, well it looks like records and uh, it looks like actually a huge DVD when you open them. As you know, I just showed you a lot of collection, but uh, of course uh, I have CD versions too, no, not only record versions, so same albums, but uh, it's actually CDs, not records. And uh, as I explained in one of the videos, uh, in my hometown back in the 90s, uh, most of single CDs looked different from American single CDs. And uh, well, the single CD was very small in my hometown. So, well, can you see this? So, very small. Very, very small. So, regular single CDs are like this. and. Uh, this was the most common single CD here in my hometown back in the 80s and 90s. So this size is pretty small. And uh, of course, as you could see, our CDs and records were much different sizes. So as you can see, pretty different even through the same album product. Well, uh, I love to download like uh, most of the people these days, but uh, I also still love to collect the actual and the real stuff, product like CDs, records, VHS tapes, laser discs, or something like that. It's really wonderful to collect the real stuff, you know? So, I would love to show you more differences of the single CDs. Uh, actually, it depends on country and uh, it was really different back in 1990s. So that's why I'm showing these differences like this. So here are those packages for single CDs in my hometown back in 90s or so. So well, it looks pretty different from United States. So maybe most of you even have no idea what it is. But uh, these are actually single CDs from 90s or so. So well, when you open those packages of the single CDs from 90s here, actually it looked like this. So yes, it's pretty small and uh, looks totally different from United States. And uh, as you can see, these are single CD packages from United States and also Europe, like England. So of course, a single CDs from United States and Europe looked like this, you looked like them. So, so as you can see, uh, those CDs. So as you can see, those CDs look totally different because of the size difference, size difference, and uh, well, left is from United States and uh, Europe, and the uh, right one is from here in my hometown, uh, still same single CDs, but uh, of course different uh, musicians, but uh, you know what I mean, these are single CDs, but the uh, sides were totally different in 90s. Anyways, thanks for checking this out, hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday and I talk to you soon, bye!